Good morning, friends. It is a cloud covered day. It is 52 degrees. We're going to drive by the old mill. It's really not old, it's actually brand new. But it's going to be a glorious day. It is Black Friday, Black Friday, Black Friday, ladies and gentlemen. I don't usually participate in Black Friday. But I may go out and look around today. You never can tell, friends. We'll get into something fun today. I'll bet you. Stay tuned. Oh, the holiday traffic, friends. This is the Rivergate Mall that we looked at yesterday. And there was nothing there. No cars there. Completely empty. And now look at today. Bunch of folks over there, a bunch of folks out here. Extra busy. Yes, indeed. Goodlettsville, friends. This is the other side of the mall, and you can see it's the mall's pretty busy, and there's traffic everywhere. Very busy, busy, busy place. All right, friends, I'm coming off of Ellington and where it says Spring Street, but to be honest with you, I don't know what Spring Street is. I don't think I've ever seen it, but I see the Spring Street exit, which really means the Dickerson Road exit to me. So we're turning right right here. This is gonna be Dickerson Road and they have something interesting at the, the beginning of Dickerson Road right here. And it's, a her, it's a, something that you've never heard of being here i bet you and what it is is a herd of i guess they consider this spring street this little connector street but it is a herd of buffalo so we're going to stop and look look at all these buffalo now, why do we have Buffalo on Dickerson Road? Anyone? Anyone? I don't know the answer to that. So let's investigate. I'm willing to bet, friends, that the vast majority of the people that live around Nashville do not even know that these Buffalo are here. That's downtown. You can see the Batman building right there. And that's I-24. The stadium is right over there. So let's walk across and take a look at these Buffalo. There's mama buffaloes and baby buffaloes and daddy buffaloes. I reckon they're all buffalo. Even if it's a mama, it's still considered a buffalo. But they're even lit up at night. And they need some attention. They're a little cracked up. They're concrete, they're hard. They need to be painted. I guess the, the horns would be a male. No, they all have horns. So, you know what? I don't know, ladies and gentlemen. But they have buffalo. Grazing. But now, I will say, when uh, if you looked at my video where I looked at the cave that Timothy DeMombrian stayed in, in the story, that they tell about Timothy DeMombrian at that time is he was trapping buffalo. So evidently buffalo were here at that time. They were they ran wild here. And so maybe that's what that is, is it's a commemoration of when buffaloes were, or buffalo, I guess I think it would be, buffalo would still be plural, but when buffalo ran wild here in Nashville, which would have been in the late, had been uh, when Timothy de Montmorin was here was 1777, so it'd be late 1700s that he was hunting buffalo. But here's the front buffalo. 
And see, that comes off of Jefferson Street right there under that bridge, and then it splits off two ways. And they're calling this Dickerson. They're calling that North First. They're saying that this is Dickerson, so I don't know where Spring Street is. I've not figured that out, but this is saying Dickerson Road. And I'm going to fly the glory over the buffalo. We're going we're gonna to get a bird's eye view of a buffalo. Yes, we are. Yes, we are, friends. And these things need some TLC, it looks like. But I will tell you that D Dickerson Road in Nashville does not have a good reputation. It's, its reputation is uh, drugs, prostitution, that kind of stuff. But they've cleaned it up a whole lot. And there was, when I moved here, this was Section 8 type housing over here. And you can see that they've redone it all. It was, it was in horrible shape, and they've redone it, repainted it, and all that kind of stuff. Um, it was actually kind of got to down again a little bit. Um, so this is a rough section of Nashville, but you can see that it's literally right off the highway, right by the city. So let's fly the glory, friends, you want to? All right, friends, so I looked up the history and why these buffalo are here, and it says that they did this, and it was in 2009, to commemorate that this area was, uh, in down, down Dickerson Road area, was where the buffalo would uh, go to get to the salt licks of the Cumberland River, which um, I'm not sure about that history. The, the salt lick that I know of is over there by Demombrian's Cave, and that's quite a ways from here. In fact, it's uh, Demombrian's Cave is on the, uh, it's on this side of the river, but it's the other direction. So they may have their, their history backwards, who knows? And they claim these things are bronze, but I found them to, to be like concrete. So there you are, friends. I'm flying the glory over. Just take a little look-see and see what you think. If you ever get a chance to go, uh, go see them. But they are in between a road. They call it Buffalo Park, but it is dangerous. Uh, there's roads, uh, two-lane roads on both sides, so there's really no easy way or safe way to get out there uh, the, uh, other than flying the glory. So if you got a glory, fly it. So that's a good thing. And there's the moons. You see just a little bit of it up in the sky.
Tighten up. <laughs>